I've had a quick I've had a quick look at the echo. Page page three. City MP hits out after death threat sent to him over active travel trial. And I'll I'll come I'll come back to it, but the the first thing I'd like to say See, th this is why it lends itself to a drama, because there's so many different um, points of view and statements of fact. Uh, yeah, now I see, I know I'm, I'm contradicting myself because I haven't looked at it properly. There is a photograph of, of protesters. Um, so there's a photograph of, of, of the, a, a clown's poster, which protesters have um, put branding the City Highways and Traffic Orders Committee as clowns. But in the in the main text, so like, I haven't read all of it yet, but I can't see reporting on the, the protests. There's, there's a group that's at County Hall on a Tuesday and they're in the High Street on a Saturday. Um, I guess they'll be there on Saturday. And I don't, I haven't seen the Echo interview in them. I'm, I could be completely wrong about that, but I'm, I'm just saying that I'm working on a, a play which is about an independent candidate in an election. I'm going to put it during May, but obviously after, after the um, the real election, um, because I'm I'm going to ask uh, other people on on Phonic to improv around it, um, around the, the bus stop that observes what's going on. Um, but this this bit this is a, this is a quote from from Ben Bradshaw. Um, Since the active travel scheme was introduced, people have voiced their streets are quiet and they can walk and cycle more safely, and their streets have less pollution. Well, I'm I'm sure some people are saying that, but there's lots of other things being said. Um, the the boundary roads, as they're known, are are busier, and there's a lot of pollution. And um, so that's one thing. But also, I, I happen to live near Robinson's News. So the South Lawn Terrace in one direction and North Street going towards the main heritage shops in another direction. And because two other routes out of that space are blocked, I'm just going to say that they're blocked. I know people use other words, but that's an easy way to describe what's going on. I think, and a lot of other people also think, using their own eyes and observing what's in front of them, that there is more traffic on North Street than previously. And uh, some other people say, based on other similar schemes, other places, that this will transform itself within 18 months and all this traffic will not be there. Uh, but I can't, I can't see how that's going to happen. Um, so in the play, this independent candidate is, is, is actually very positive about 20 mile an hour limits and also zebra crossings. Uh, they favour more zebra crossings on South Lawn Terrace because of the increase in traffic and um, if that doesn't happen, a complete rethink on the scheme. Um, scrap, scrap the scheme, start again, have a, an actual consultation. Because um, do people feel that they were consulted? I'd, 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 obviously, death threats are not not a good idea. But you might you might just think, well, how has that come about? If if there was um, the perception, I mean, and again, this is why I go, go back to drama. Um, Devon County Council, they have boards which explain that consultation has happened, but there's there's other people who who either didn't hear about it, which may be their, their fault, I mean, I'm one of those people, um, or go to meetings which they think are consultative but um, are actually uh, informative. Um, uh, the, it, the, there may be other people who describe those differently, and as I say, that that all that all this is the, the phonic drama show. So this is all this is all good material for working out a play. That's one one way of looking at it. Um, but um, so the 
the, here's another quote from Ben Bradshaw. The, the, the way to engage with this is to make your feelings known to your local councillors who will engage, empathise and consult. If at the end of the day you don't like the final, final outcome, then vote for some other councillor. That's how democracy works. Not death threats, vandalism, damaging councillors' property or some far-right conspiracy groups that have attached themselves to elements of this campaign. OK, um... Far-right conspiracy groups do not come out of nowhere. There's always some basis for it, how other, however peculiar. That's all I, I think I'm going to... I shall, I shall give, give this um, a break now. Um, King, King Curtis, 